Hey, how's it going? John Ellison here. In this week's Happy Habit, I want to talk about talking with strangers. Striking up a conversation with somebody in line, on a bus, on a train, whatever it is. Just the whole phenomena of speaking to somebody that you don't know. The research on this is quite astounding in that most people believe that talking to a stranger is going to be a really unpleasant experience and isn't going to increase their happiness. But they're wrong. The small effect of saying hello to somebody, looking them in the eyes, asking how their day is going, having a chit chat about the weather is really profound. And the, the science kind of demonstrates that we're actually designed to interact with people. Our minds are hardwired for social connection. And yet the world in which we live often deprives us of this. And you look in the world around us and most people in social contexts have their phone in their hands, often looking at a screen instead of being in the people around them. And this is really sad because now more than ever, people are reporting higher levels of depression, anxiety, and loneliness. And the science shows that loneliness is more detrimental to your physical health than smoking 15 cigarettes a day. This is craziness. The world around us is insane and yet we kind of accept it blindly. So I really encourage you to give this one a try, even if you don't feel like you want to do it, counter to much of what I've said before. Put your phone away in a bag or in something that you can't reach easily. Recognize that dopamine rush of you trying to itch for that phone and that interaction and just observe the people around you. Get a few phrases that you feel comfortable with that you can strike up a conversation easily. Mine are, hey, how's it going? How's your day going so far? What's new with you these days? They're simple canned responses that I feel comfortable with and I can kind of pull out in any setting. And they're effective. Most people are genuinely willing to interact, at least at some level of depth. And every now and then I find that some people really open up and surface. And some beautiful things can happen, especially for people who are often overlooked and neglected in the day-to-day -day life. So see what you think, give this one a try and let me know how it goes. I'd be really curious to hear about your experience. And as always, no matter what happens, just be kind to yourself. See if you can adopt a part of a child, a playful, curious exploration of this whole journey of what it's like to be human and how we can be happy in this crazy world we live in. Have a great day and we'll see you next week. Thanks.